Summer provides extra challenges for firefighters battling smoke and flames, all while wearing that heavy gear. Well, this morning in Suffolk, crews responded to a business fire on North Main Street. It was hot and humid out there. 10 on your side's Andrew Robinson shows you what firefighters do during the dangerous heat to try and stay cool. With the summer heat and sizzle from the scorching pavement, it's not the most comfortable for these Suffolk firefighters. The gear that they wear has three layers um, to help prevent being burned and also the steam from the fire when you put water on it. Um, and that's incredibly heavy and it also just totally like insulates you from you know, you, all the heat that you're building up inside and the heat from the fire, it's just doubled. This morning around 10 a.m., Suffolk Fire and Rescue responded to reports of smoke coming out of this laundromat. One person was taken to the hospital and is expected to recover. The heat from the flames and exertion from their duties can be strenuous. Normally you can take your gear off and cool down, but here you just take your gear off and you're still hot. Today's highs in the 90s, which can get warm quickly under those three layers of protective suits. And that's why Suffolk Fire and Rescue have this rehab center. We're fortunate um, to have the, the rehab bus back there. So um, as firefighters are able to, as the workload determines, they're able to go take breaks where we check their blood pressure, their temperature, their pulse. Um, they stay there for 20 minutes, and the bus is also air conditioned, so they, they have a chance to kind of chill out and cool down before they have to go back to work. Making sure that Suffolk's bravest are well taken care of before the next call. In Suffolk, Andrew Robinson, 10 on your side.